coming in as the central government has moved the apex sport challenging the ban on 10 year old diesel vehicles let's recall it was last year where the supreme court had come out with this verdict that all vehicles that are 10 years old and are diesel need to come off roads they will have an expiry date of 10 years and 15 years for all petrol vehicles because of the emissions and the amount of pollution that they create after being so old but to that the center has now challenged that move against uh, the NGT order that had come in in the Supreme Court. The central government in the past also has challenged the NGT's order to phase out those diesel vehicles in Delhi that are more than 10 years. Let's go across to my colleague Abhimanyu joining us with further detail. Abhimanyu, talk us through how the government is challenging the NGT order, order on that 10-year-old ban on diesel vehicles. Well, the government has uh, gone to the apex court challenging the NGT order to which the apex court stated that the government needs to put in all the papers uh, uh, related to the case, all the documents related to the case, as well as the copy of the order of the NGT requires to be filed, which the government did not the law while challenging uh, the previous order of the NGT, to which, of course, the Supreme Court observed that uh, the, the, this amounted to casual attitude on the part of the government as far as the serious matter was concerned, and the court stated that the court any hearing government has to file, uh, will have to file all the documents related to the case before the Supreme Court. Of course, the government's uh, rationale uh, behind this, uh, per, uh, per se, uh, uh, in this particular case, is not clear as of now. But in course of hearing of the case, before the NGT, when the case was going on, the government, of course, uh, was uh, resisting the move to ban uh, the 10 year old diesel vehicles. The government had stated. Uh, several uh, several factors and points, and it is expected that the government will read read its uh, uh, its stance uh, before the apex. Okay, court. Abhimani, how, how different? How different is this plea of the central government vis-à-vis -vis the last one? Because even the last time around, the central government, I remember last year, had challenged the NGT's order to phase out these diesel vehicles. So, how different is this uh, move than the last one? Well, the prime difference is that uh, on, on the basis of uh, increasing pollution in uh, the national capital and also on the base, basis of several independent reports which had stated that uh, along with uh, increasing years of time and uh, along with uh, 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 the age of the vehicle, the efficiency of the vehicle and uh, the calorific value of the fuel which was burned, that adversely affected the environment. That uh, Those were the findings of several reports based on which the NGP had given its order, which was, of course, being disputed by the center, so certainly uh, the arguments of the center would range around uh, th these arguments itself, which they had presented before the NGT when the case had come up for hearing. Of course, the center might bring up some okay. new pieces of facts or some new arguments too, as okay. far as the, chal uh, the challenging of the previous NGT order is concerned. All right, we'll leave it at that for a moment, Abhimanyu. Thanks very much for joining us with those details.